So for today, we're going to be looking at Ada 1 and what she is offering. If you guys don't know, we usually look at what she's offering. So shaders and armor set, and we actually show you all the armor. So you get, that way you guys are informed of how it looks. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. Other than that, oh, Dark Amalon. So let's talk about it. Dark Amalon is a cool shader. That being said, I guess the only thing that I've been picky about is just the white. If it was any other color, I think this would have been a banger, but it's also the distressed color on the pants as well. I'm not the biggest fan of other than that. I think it had so much potential to actually be really, really cool. Uh, Bray Innovation. This one is from shit. Technically season three, considering that one was War Mine. So this is an old shader. It actually looks pretty cool with the set that I have on it right now. I would probably just switch out the cloak color for a black color. Um, but other than that, yeah, it looks actually pretty decent with this. We have Dead Orbit's Fate. This is Vanilla Destiny 2, or yeah, Vanilla Destiny 2, so Season 1. Damn, this is old. Also a really good black and white shader if you are interested in that. Definitely really cool with this set as well. I probably would just switch out the, again, the cloak for a deeper black, because uh, this one has a problem that it has like uh, discoloration on a lot of it. And yeah, I would actually, I would actually switch out the the cloak and just that's it because that's all it needs because everything else looks really really cool as for the armor set i'm gonna be hopping into the collections because i don't remember the other classes but for the icarus for the hunters i think it's okay um there is a lot of problems with it though like first and foremost the helmet the visor the like lines on it doesn't change color i think the arms are pretty boring chest piece i, I, I remember correctly has a piece that doesn't change color i just don't remember which it is um boots i think are boring and then the cloak i think looks cool but doesn't change color for a specific parts so that's really annoying titans you guys ended up getting the uh terra concord that's right and the helmet definitely has potential to be something really really cool i think the arms in and the boots are completely worthless chest piece has potential and the mark is cool because it's not your typical mark because it is a uh, just two pieces of cloth at the back so that is cool, but I'm not the biggest fan of it. And Warlocks, I actually really hate yours. Um, mostly because the helmet looks very boring. Like a lot of it's just kind of tack, like whatever. The arms, boring. Chest piece, boring. Boots, boring. Bond, boring. Like I think the only thing I can say that's not boring is the helmet. And even then it just looks like, um, actually I'll show you guys right now. So that way you guys are aware of what I'm thinking of, but it's basically where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Hold on. So it's this no. Yeah, this one right here. It's basically that one. Which is why I'm not the biggest fan of it. Uh, and then the chest piece for this one is basically just um over here. This one. The Philomath robes, which this is the superior one in my opinion. And the art the boots look very generic and the arms look very generic. So honestly the the Tesseract Trace uh four complete ass so that's pretty much it let me know what you guys think i definitely think the some of the shaders are definitely worth a pickup especially these two just because these two are super old um this one you can pick up or not i really don't care but for the armor i guess i always have the adage of it's better to need it and not have it no wait it's better to have it and not need it than to need it and not have it so if you guys want you guys can definitely pick it up that being said again that this is like what is it uh 51 Wait, yeah, 125. So 125 legendary shards for one class. For all of them, it's 375, which is wild. Um, especially, it's it's especially wild to ask for it from like a guardian that doesn't have 9,000 uh, legendary shards. So like for newer players that are like, I barely have 100, definitely skip out on this one because there's way better armor sets because not only do we have 801 selling armor sets we also have Zer selling some armor sets as well that when he comes so i would just say always wait until Zer comes in so that way you guys are like okay cool like i think the Zer set stuff is better so i'll just pick that up or it's like okay well i don't like the Zer stuff so i'll just pick up the 801 stuff just a better it's better to just be safe than sorry so let me know what you guys think i appreciate you guys be safe i will see you guys later